All right, so so many of you asked me for the recipe to this potato hash kidamari that I made, and I don't blame you because, as I said, oh my gosh, that's so good. Luckily, it's really easy to make. You start with one potato, which I julienned using a mandoline. You can also just chop it if you like. You're going to throw that into some cold water in order to get rid of some of the excess starch. And I would do that for at least 30 minutes. And then you're going to pat it dry so that you don't have excess water on the potatoes. I know it's all like very backwards, but trust me, you have to do this if you want the crispy crispy. Then you're going to add some salt, pepper, some vegan cheese, which is optional, and one tablespoon of potato starch. I'm going to add a little bit of vegan butter to my nonstick pan as well as the potatoes and then I'm going to pour about a quarter cup of just egg over the top. I also added a slice of vegan cheese just because that's my business as Tabitha Brown likes to say. And then you're just going to roll it up kind of like a crepe or like a kid on muddy and that's basically it. Let it cool for a few seconds and then you dig in.